We've just come down to a market today. I think this is called the Old Biscuit Mill. I've been here before in my vlogs, but um, I just met up with Eleanor and Shay. And um, yeah, these guys are from Unilad Adventure. Yeah, I am actually. Oh, okay. She's my boyfriend. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, um, just here on a holiday. Yeah. yeah, awesome. How are you finding Cape Town? Oh man, it's sick. It's literally my favorite place I've been to. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's good we finally got to meet up. Raya's wandering over there, we're going to find some lunch. Just got a lovely coffee. And uh, yeah, it's a, it's a good day. Most days here are good. Right, this is what we're going for for lunch. Oh, it's got like a charcoal bun. Yeah. Wow, look at that. And I was like, without a doubt. <laughs> Guys, this is Oli. Uh, I met him a while ago at this place, Rosetta, but he has a little store here. If you're ever here in the market, Oli's speciality coffee, but I'm just buying some from him. Thank you, man. Thank you so much, Lou. Cool. Pleasure to see you. Yeah, pleasure to see you. you mind if I take a picture with Yeah, you? let's do it, let's do it. Guys, this is an incredible coffee. Incredible coffee. How is your day going? Yeah, it's nice. And yours? Nice. Oh. Today is the day that I am handing over the big 12 terabyte hard drive to the head editor, Nick, who's gonna start um, shaping the documentary. And uh, yeah, it's been, I haven't been uploading a lot recently because I've been sitting in my office, just like sorting through files, um, connecting interviews with audio files, loads of stuff like that. Um, anyway, it's all done now. And uh, yeah, it's an exciting day. It's a big step towards getting the documentary done. Okay guys, I've arrived at Nick's house. He happens to live in Mannenberg, which has a bad reputation. Um, and historically, there's been a lot of violence here and it's yeah, it's not the safest place in Cape Town. I came a few years ago and um, I don't know if you remember that vlog, but there were some gangs and I was in a bit of a risk because I had all my cameras out. Anyway, the Uber driver, as I got in, um, he was a little bit wary about driving me here, but it's all good and um, Nick and his wife are doing some cool projects here. What are you guys doing here? What called you out here um, to live in Manenberg? It's a long story, but I guess I realised that I had a lot of privilege and people were really struggling and I thought I'd basically use my skill, which is video editing, video making and kind of make it part of Manenberg and say, look, do you want, do you want me? I'm part of the kind of team Manenberg. So, and my wife's running a crash for like local kids who are like, whose parents are drug addicts and that kind of stuff who, who are just really struggling. Wow, that's cool. So I'll, I'll do a whole vlog where we kind of, I want to shine a light on the projects Nick is involved with here and, um, but for now, we're just going to get, um, cause he's in a bit of a rush today. Um, we're just going to check this drive and see if we can get the edit started. I bought some little squares and like some sellotape. Cause I thought if we, um, so we can put all our brainstorming. Yeah, I'll say, I'll go and go. Yeah, I like it. Guys, this uh, this little room that Nick's built is like perfectly soundproof. So we're gonna do a lot of, hopefully our voiceover stuff. He said he got a bit obsessed. He said, this is a, these are bass traps and this is a diffuser. And yeah, it's all kind of DIY, but it sounds great in here for, for voiceovers. I was just saying your, uh, the soundproofing's amazing. Okay, okay, so we've got these. Little squares of paper, sellotape. Some ideas we just put really... Nice, it's like storyboarding. Storyboarding. Yeah, yeah. Try and get the story together. Sweet. Okay, we've left Nick's house and we've come down to a little church group. This is a project that they're involved with in Mannenberg, Tree of Life. And um, yeah, it's... I'm not sure what to expect, but I'm hoping to meet some cool people, see what they're doing in this area. And uh, yeah. Just, just tagging along really, but this is cool. And I've also found out, I don't know if you guys remember, like I think that last year when I was in Cape Town, I went to a project in Nyango, and that's like actually the housing district like opposite uh, Manenberg. So it's quite near 
that and they were doing uh, the group I was visiting then were doing some similar projects as these guys are doing here so it's cool to see good things happening Each other is what's the good news? What's the good news this week in your life? Somebody said to you today, describe who you are. I wonder what you would say. Just stop and think about that for a minute. How would you describe yourself? I don't mean tall, wide, blonde, bearded, not, not blonde, sorry. <laughs> Yo, who are you? So what gang's on this side of the road? This side is the channel's odd, the least. And which side? gang's on this side? Um, the other side you'll get your Americans and the uh... I have headed over to the other side of the mountain near Camps Bay um, to Kyle's house who I was hanging out with last week. Yeah, I'm gonna go and hang out with the boys that chill in here and meet all the dogs. Hey guys! <laughs> Guys, this is Milo. Milo's very cool. How are you doing, Milo? Hey! <laughs> also, this wrap I ordered. I just had one. This is from Kauai. These are really, really cool. These are delicious. Got a little smoothie hanging with these guys. I did. Guys, you remember Benjamin from Iceland when we were travelling around the world? And his friend Donnell. Yeah, um, these guys are heading to Namibia. When, like, in a few days or? Yeah. So make sure you follow their adventures. I'll link them below. How nice is it over this side? By the way, Raya just arrived. We need to, yeah, we've got the last three weeks where we don't have anywhere that we're staying yet, so I think we should definitely come to this side. Oh yeah, so the, the, um, the house we're staying in is only to the end of what? March? Yeah, something like that. Okay. We have three weeks, basically. Okay, and then we have another <laughs> yeah. three weeks off that to stay somewhere. Oh, got the coffee, chilling. This is the vibes, this side of the mountain. Guys, look at the sky! When the clouds came in, I was like, oh, it's kind of a shame because there wasn't like a crazy sunset, but now it is mad. Look how pink it is. That is sick. Right, we're jumping in Bryn's car. We're heading down to this kind of open street party vibe thing and gonna get some food, meet up with some others. Oh. Mojo Market. Right, we came here yesterday. Um, we had a little walk around, got some hummus, but we're back for dinner. And uh, sounds like there's some live music. back home and um, I don't know if you noticed guys but with today's vlog I kind of merged um, snippets from different days mainly because I don't really want to upload three minute vlogs and I haven't been out all day doing things like I usually do with my vlogging I've actually like I said been staying a lot at home getting things done um, anyway it's been a slow start to the year but I'm excited about um, kind of creating content for you guys, trying to do new types of videos as well and working with a bunch of creative people here to get things done. So yeah, I'm excited to be down here and I cannot wait to, um, yeah, to do some new things and to take you guys on the journey as well. One of the big things that's going to be happening, I'm going to talk more about it and do a big announcement, but we are doing an influencer trip which is happening next month, inviting some people down and uh, we're doing yeah a bunch of cool things 
Anyway, I'll let you know more about that. I'll let you know details, but that's one of the things I'm planning. And uh, yeah, I guess I will catch you tomorrow. Peace out, enjoy life, and live the adventure. Boom.